Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jacob Restituto. I'm a musician from Northport, New York, and today we are reacting and breaking down Algorithm by Childish Gambino off his 31520 album. Looking forward to hearing this. It's interesting, though, that he released 31520 on 32220, like a week later. Just an interesting concept. I also want to comment on how it's just a white, just white for his album cover. Very interesting. Um, but I would classify him actually more, Childish Gambino is more of an artist than I would as an, a musician. He is all around just like, like I feel like a true artist. So looking forward to hearing the song Algorithm right now. Nice. Some really dirty kind of drums going on, like some just uh, like like glitchy kind of sounds, like a digital kind of sounds, and just super distorted. And really nice uh, use of the stereo spectrum. There's a lot of things going on left and right ears, like filling it up. That was a cool lyric. It came out of Mother Earth smelling like roses, like a flower. Very clever. Uh, cool effect on the the the, the vocals, the vocals right here. Um, nice and like just, I would say like very affected. Uh, very cool sound. Very cool, nice. I like this con contrast between the the very affected vocals, almost computerized sounding vocals, to now this very like very nice classic kind of sounding singing with some layered vocals. We have the, the left and right ear, and then the octave up. Nice. It's cool how you're saying clap your hands, but in, in here there's a clap in the production. I feel like if you took out the vocals, it'd sound very Billie Eilish style production uh, by Phineas. That's cool, sounds like it's pitch shifted down an octave. Stereo vocals. Glitching out. You hear the really nice use of the stereo spectrum, though. <laughs> kind of sounds like it's farting out. Uh. 
<laughs> that was very interesting. That was Algorithm by Childish Gambino of his new album, 31520. Uh, very interesting. It was some really cool production stuff in there. You know what? As much as like it's kind of kind of out there, the music um, to my to my like personal taste, um, I do know that the production there's a lot of value in the production because that production is hard to make. There's a lot of stuff that goes into it. There's just so many different elements and plugins and effects that you're adding to all these things. Like compared to just recording an acoustic guitar and a and a, a singer, like that stuff is hard to make. So serious props to him. Um, pretty cool stuff, like some really cool uses of the vocals. I really liked how the vocals are processed. Like I couldn't even tell you how to process that. Like maybe I could try some stuff, but like I don't even know what they would do in other vocals to make them sound like that. Th that being the point, it's some it's I think it's really cool and it takes some skill to make stuff like that. Um, yeah, let me know what you think. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this kind of music. Um, and as always, you can leave a comment if you want me to react to your favorite songs. And if you want to check out my music, it's Jake Bursatuto, wherever you listen. Peace out. It's all about one.